All right, every week our puppy with a purpose stops in to show us how his journey's coming along. Lauren Cobb's here, his trainer, and we went out with Izzy to Piedmont Park. Yeah, we did. Yep, let's check out some of the things that we learned outside the studio. My goal is just to socialize him and to let him explore the world and get comfortable with the world. So I'm going to reinforce him for not being nervous about the truck coming by. Nice. So we want to make sure when they're really young like this that they're not afraid of anything very close to something very large. It was very loud. So I had a very high rate of reinforcement. Oh, good boy. All right, this way. Thank you. Then I gave him a lot of kibble for not being reactive towards the truck and trying to either run towards it or run away from it. When he's working, we want him to not run up to children. He loves to play with kids. If a little kid maybe comes up and asks to pet him, then I want him to remain nice and calm and relaxed in a sit. Good job. Passing these ducks, come on. Izzy's never seen these before, nice. So he's looking at them, but he's staying next to my left side, which is perfect. The next step for Izzy is he will go in for formal training when he's around 16 months. At that time, he'll be matched with a guide dog trainer. After that, he'll be matched with his visually impaired handler, and they will also go through team training for about 10 days, and then he'll be a fully fledged guide dog. Good boy. 